Today you're going to learn how to install the Newport Bypass Shower Door by Coastal Industries. Start by unboxing your unit. Make sure you have all the parts. A list of parts is included in your instruction manual. Measure the base opening of the shower enclosure. Trim sill to the measurement obtained. Trim the vinyl sill to 1 and 1 8 inch less than the base opening. With the high lip toward the exterior of the enclosure, position the sill at the center of curb and tape it. Push the notch wall jams down over the sill and up against the shower walls. Plumb the jam and then pencil mark the installation hole locations. Use a 3 16 inch drill bit to drill installation holes. Reposition the wall jams and secure them to the walls. In the center of the wall jam, install the jam bumpers. On the shower head wall, install the jam guide into the bottom hole of the wall jam. Measure the width at the top of the enclosure. Trim the header to 1 16th inch less than the measurement obtained. Position the header in place. Place the inside panel into the shower. Install the outside door panel by lifting the panel up and into the header. Lower the panel and engage the rollers. Repeat those steps for the inside panel. If needed, adjust the rollers to make sure the door panel is parallel with the wall jam. Open the shower enclosure so that both door panels are up against the same wall jam. Locate the center of the sill and position the track guide on the sill. Secure guide to the sill using self-tapping screws. Next you'll want to install the towel bars. Make sure that you attach the inner brackets first. To ensure a watertight operation, run a bead of clear mildew-resistant caulk along the outside of the shower enclosure. 